frozen. That's what happens. <laughs> we try to be pros. But... I'm, I'm, I mean, I'm happy that we are being called pros. <laughs> I'm not complaining myself, I tell you what. Now we get here, now you're playing. But I think a pro is not the position you're in. It's your ability you to deliver the work. That's it. There are people that work in these places that would have left me to, to mess up a shot. Akuluma, the end, you go to Asia. Aish, man. You have a thing like Conan, but you didn't say shit, man. I go to Lee, it's always the time. It's my answer, and I won't shake, I won't get into it. Language. In terms of freedom, boy. No my say I'm Make it happen with kids. A podcast that gives you tools, information, as well as fact and experience you need to start from where you are, using as little as you have. To realize your dreams and make it happen. <laughs> Welcome to it, my doctor. Don't play. Yes. Thank you. you know the name of the show is called Make It Happen with Kiss. Yes, sir. Do you know why we call it Make It Happen with what Kiss? What are we making happen? So, so, so the idea, the idea, the idea. Radio made me start this show. Mm -hmm. Radio, a lot of my niggas are asking me, Boy, when's I got Johnny? That's yeah. like, you know, my kid with uh, TV ads and all of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the idea was that, I'm going to ask you to meet my kids, but they got dreams. Mm. So what I'm going to ask you to meet my kids, but they got dreams. Dog, a dream could be anything from being a taxi driver, which we had, could be a DJ, could be an actor, could sure. be a radio presenter. So what we're trying to do is we're trying to bring everybody that is making it happen in their own mm -hmm. space. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's dope. Was the Yeah. Um let's start with the TV because right now my Before we start with the TV, my dog. Yeah. You come from a pot. You come yeah. from a pot where you were cooked. Yeah. This is the result. Right. We see the result on TV. Right. Right? We right. see it. We see it in the work, the amazing work that you've done. Uh -huh. I mean, I've been told, you know. Well, like, don't get into my head, but okay. You're not saying Sure, sure, sure. He's a smoking poop. And which is why you are here. Upume Kimba. Upuma Upume Kimba. Kaslam, my friend. Khalishi, we're in Pupeng. 97 Kekisho Street. Don't you think, My pop city. I get to Kimberley the first time. Uh, 2009. Kona E Khalishi. Yeah. Your bouquet or Rikis, 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 I can take us with the Korean Africans to me. So, no, Africans are liars. Africans are liars. Hey, 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 Africans but you know the difference between I number two, Homestead, Shop White, Mount Lee, Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Pegola compared to one and Pratt. A 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 Pratt. You kind of have to adapt to what is required. Mm. Um, and it's funny, as I was driving here to your spot now, you just took me way back. Because I used to stay Fielding Crescent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Monday Green. Green. Monday Green. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So it was during those times where I had to kind of adjust because it didn't pass. Yeah. Mm -hmm. As soon as we got to Joburg, though, language instructions and everything you're auditioning for means your Zulu needs to be on point. Yeah. yeah, because now you're Joseph Eli. This is Zulu. Yeah, he's a scholar. Yeah. He's a scholar. And, uh, and, and uh, yes, it's like the name. We, 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 like, we speak, we speak something nice. We speak something that is a um, melting pot of different languages. Mm -hmm. sure. But for TV casting, it's almost a you know book 
ready language type that you need to know the language properly. Yes, so yes. I kind of threw myself into learning this is Zulu. Um, and, and, and that kind of gave me the direction of the kind of roles I'm getting. It's only later on now that I'm getting more Kosa roles. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah. And, and just like um, a diversity. But when's I think about the dog? It's kind of unfair too. Um, man, uh, like a hood is a hood is a hood, right? It's a gas. Like, like one thing these busters of apartheid did, like <laughs> spatial planning <laughs> of one casi to another. You know, fine. It's a fine. Yeah. It's a fine. Sure, it's a language. It's a fine. Yeah, my head is a fine. Yeah, my head is a fine. Yeah. You know? Um, I'm often in, 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 like, in hoods in Joburg where I'm sometimes like, yes, this feels like... That's this exactly feels like Jordan. Yeah. Yeah, especially more so. Especially more so. Hamba, pinoni na Yeah, those cases, there's yeah. especially especially pinoni. You know, we feeling yeah, na man, seventy lani. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Those smaller. And then it later la M G Ba Ikimba. Yeah, yeah. So for I know you went to CBC. I went to CBC. Making us a masterpiece. The, ah, the, the, the basher, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we had the basher, that hard straw hat. Hey, this is yeah, yeah, fun. Like, we had to wear, we had to wear blazers, no man. And <laughs> Kimberly's hot, you know this, right? Hot AF. Jesus. In that heat, we did like school rules were in public, you must always have your blazer on. Mm. So, standard practice. If you are walking to the taxi rank after, mm. your blazers on, your bashers on. Always that was your whole, your, your whole schooling, your yeah, whole that was my 12 years. 12 years, grade 1 to grade 12. My only struggled through that, uh, me and my younger brother. Yeah, yeah. But she made it work. And we, like, we ask ourselves, how now? Because when I look at school fees, I'm just like, hey, how does this lady manage to you say, you say, you say, you only know about Brazil. Uh, like Brazil, Brazil, and I've had this conversation, um, not from day but Brazil, my time I had, and I appreciated him much later the role he played and the fathering he actually did do. Yeah, yeah. But with certain things, he was just like, no nah, man, hang on, fine. Because initially, he was against the idea of us going to an upmarket private school. Why? He's a bit of a politician. For him, it was, you know, children are of the soil. Yeah. They need to be here at grassroots level with everybody. Uh, why are we elevating these ones? Unfortunately, Ah, um, oh, what, what do you mean? I don't know if I'm elevator. No, 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 no. Uh, but his thing was, and I think it's, you know, political ideology. He doesn't want us to lose touch with. Uh, is that thing of of, of, of of the success that you have yeah. now, right? Um, the tough conditions you have gone through in your life yeah. have made you a relatively successful man. Yeah, but because I mean, of I mean, all I know, it's you know all I mean? the toughness that made me like now, this. Now, unfortunately, for your kids in that next generation, they're gonna be a little softer than you were, Pretty because much. you've been able to lay everything yeah. nicely for them, set them up. So that they don't have to struggle and crawl like you did. Yeah. They're going straight into grade schools, getting picked up in a car by daddy every day, getting taken to their sports thingies. As um, a reason, what did he do? There we go. You know what I mean? Mm. Daddy, can I please uh, hook up my Bluetooth? Yeah. I want to play such and such a song. Exactly. You know what I mean? There's privilege there. I mean, I won't try, but, yeah, I'm that, but what we are creating <laughs> is privileged kids. Pretty much. Absolutely. By the time they're older, they'll only realize later on would yeah, that guy that nice. You know? Talking about kids, we enjoy the fifth thing. Wonderful news. The wonderful news. I mean cut you in bananas. The like the thing is I don't eat cake. You know? I, mean, like, I, mean, I, mean, I don't eat cake. So I always forget. But it's time for the cake to be dished out, I'm just like, ah, I'm missing it. It's like, I'm poor for cake. <laughs> <I'm poor laughs> <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Yeah, man, this is Friday, you must. Be 15 for that. I had to call old lady on some, uh, mama, or my daughter. Is this thing to be? Hey, like, 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 no, what do you think? Like, check the poster. Sirene, the jumping castles here, the water slide is in effect, come through. Boy, there's, there's, you know, it is good about the way I will like There's yeah. things people don't know. We'll touch on the acting career and everything. Yeah. You, you do a lot of stuff. <clears throat> Excuse me. Outside of, 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 um, outside of acting. Yeah. Yeah. You've been a brand ambassador for the Northern Cape Tourism. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You've been a brand ambassador for passion, passion. Jeez, yeah, no, you don't have to. I'm not 
acting, talk to me about why why do you dab into corporate and mm. and all of the communication stuff that you yeah. also do with the branding and the marketing yeah. stuff? What's up with all of that? What's up with all of that? Because I, people don't know this about you. Yeah. Look, I feel there's much more that I've got to offer the world and my immediate world mm. than just acting. Yeah. Because acting is a very pretty lie. Yeah. We are portraying other people, we are portraying other lives over there. Yes. But you never get to hear from me what I might have to offer, my little bit of intelligence, my little bit of experience in the world, um, and how I might view the world. But I think evil prevails in the world because good men sit back and say or do nothing. Okay. You know? Yeah. Um, I don't want to sit there in my bubble, my cocoon. You were a celebrity. This is this is it. This is, this is, it. This is all me and Sandra. No. I mean I was asked I was asked it must have been like 21, 22. First time I was going overseas for uh plays, you know, the sense of something through Market Theatre, mm. a play called The Island. Yeah. And I remember we were in the US, came back and there was a lot of questions at the time that would you consider moving? to the US and, you know, taking it to that next level in terms yeah. of your acting yes. and breaking through over there. Everybody wants to do that, no? Everybody wants to do that. Essentially, that's the dream. It's kind of like the benchmark. That's the thing that right? I made. Is that if you can crack that, yeah. you've cracked the world, you know? Yeah. Uh, and I generally had a feeling of like, I don't want to do that. I, I, I have absolutely no interest in doing that. Don't have it's, it's, it's a saturated market. Yeah. There's a lot of really talented actors who get their brain for five, you know? Um, there's a lot of people doing that already. Yes. But my most important thing, and the factor that really hits home with me, if Servaya Sonke is the most talented ones and go enrich another industry, who's doing that here? Yeah, we'll open who's raising the left over here? Yeah. You know what I mean? Yes. Who's changing those things? And I think everything I do outside of acting is with that in mind, is that there's so much in terms of you know, social development, uh, in terms of reaching out to kids, in terms of just being an inspiration and, 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 and them having an example of someone to, to speak to and look at and say, that guy, I can relate. And you do that right now through, your, through, through, through the uh, outreaches that you do. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Right. Um, right. I, I, saw, I saw one of your interviews where you said, Uti, now you are starting to realize how, how, how you were privileged. Yeah. And, and you are now sharing that with Definitely. other kids. Definitely. So, and, and for me, it's very important to recognize your privilege mm. so that you know the responsibility you have in, 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 in giving back at some level. Mm. You know? And I think that's the biggest thing time I taught. Yeah. Um, because once you did accept the idea that, okay, it's fine, you know? So, but I know that was a so, face. <laughs> Please, you're out of there. <laughs> but one of the things that he insisted on was if we're going to buy you all of this expensive equipment and you're going to learn games like cricket, you're going to learn how to play rugby and whatnot, the least you're going to do is teach the others around you and play with them here. Yeah, yeah. A hey, gas. Yeah. You know? So my equipment usually always went to that. All of my old stuff. So you have your stuff, so that's a scary. Okay. There's a kind of old stuff. There's a little shit, no much. Yeah. You know? And within two or three years, we actually organized like a young cricket team and we were playing for money against like other cassis. Uh, like you see, like a pet ball, much lower. Much lower. Yeah, we used to do that stuff. Like it's like, it's like, it's it's like, like, it's 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 uh, I think it's instilled the idea that you are only privileged um, to to impart that privilege on other people. You know, take other people up with you. Yeah, I mean, success exactly. is for everybody. Absolutely. And if it can help in aiding or helping somebody succeed Absolutely. and getting to their point, yeah. which is what Make It Happen is all about. Right. Right. Giving you the tools and the information that you need to start. Information. From where you are. Information is a privilege. Yeah. Right? You know? Use it. Mm -hmm. Use what you have, mm -hmm. use the information, we'll figure it out before we figure it out.
what you do. Avid sport fan. Ah. Oh, yes, tired of the sports. Like, wow. Because a few years ago, this business touch rugby Sundays. Oh, yes, sir. I'm on this I'm on this Sunday afternoon. Where's that? 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 Where's yeah, COVID came and the destabilized us a little bit. Uh, we're still around, but we're doing more corporate now. We did Josie Tens the other day. Yeah, yeah, I saw, um, I saw, I saw. Yeah, so we do call outs for that kind of thing. Same but it's probably because, because, no? Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's probably because I'm now in Centurion. Mm. So now the commute yeah. every Sunday became a bit of a. So we still yeah. play socially. We still play socially. And it was amazing, man. Yeah. You, I remember the idea for that was that you wanted to kind of start a. When I say a sports academy, if I may, yeah, a development sports academy yeah. where you wanted, yeah. which yeah. was a net boiling, I you get to rugby, for sure, whatever, whatever, whatever. What we wanted was a nice piece of land to start our own clubhouse. I know you were working on it. Yeah, city what of work and whatnot. Hey, politics. Mm. We just kept getting pushed, you know, further and further down the road. You know, they yeah. they, they make an initial promise, come back and speak to us in two months' time. I like, I think we presented at least four, or five different times to different panels. Yes. Um, so it's still essentially in the works. And you you leaving right. this with Umati? With Umati, uh, with um, our other guy, Saber and Boltina. Um, but yeah, we had a proper foot on committee, you know, Umati and I were the founders. I remember of coming to present for, a, 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 what was it we were doing for a charity event? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I remember that we did. Uh, you guys were amazing, I must say. Shout out to you for that, Namachet. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what happened was, I'm doing, I've got this charity event that I do, right? Uh, uh, try and do it every year. Sometimes in Yobu, and yeah. COVID, yeah, by the season. Dope. Dope. And 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 I went to my chance. I was like, "Yo, chance, I'm doing this charity event." And the guys were like, "Yeah, so when? Tell us, date, time. We'll be there." Without even asking, with manje, yeah, You guys were amazing. You yeah. pulled through. Yeah, gave yeah. kids ama rugby balls, <laughs> boots, had clinics My guy, it was nice. It was oh, nice. Boy. You know, that was that. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna have an action and we should do something. Matt was saying. Kulmana, because um, in the Babis, man, eight Babis in the estate. Nanga, dog, man, and such on the ten TV. They are TV, I am, but I must ask for a turn, dog. I'm alive, my guy. Dog, so was a telephone in it. Me DVD and is dating to me, Mark, and it's a man, a man, a man. Yeah, I'm a new TV, I'm a dog, man. I'm all over like a land rover. My eight hundred, I think. But of course, this is just a miser, it is just a mummy. Yes, sir. Yes sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. yes, sir. So he says, we, yeah, we, we, should, we should hook up something this year, but I think we're late for September now. No, we're late for September, but the year's not done. I yeah, the year's not done. You can still do yeah, something. End of year, drive, yeah. Something, you know, for the kids, yeah. you know? Something so prior. For sure. Play sports. For sure. And, 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 and have a good day. We're always down for that because it doesn't feel like work, you know? Vision View. Vision, Vision View Sports Radio. Yes. Yes. About Boney TV. Yes. That's yeah. the one about confirmer only by what they know you for, right? Yeah. If we no longer see you on TV, ah, ah, appreciate it. Ah, appreciate it. You know? from Los Angeles. <laughs> at some point. Look, and the simple truth is, fame in this country doesn't pay. No. You genuinely get the money. Once you start producing, yes. yes, fame, like yeah, fame. You on a wage, you on a salary, you know. Yeah. Salary credit, but you know, it's 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 a month to a month to a month. You shoot for four months. Yeah, we told you that. Look, let's say three hundred thousand in total for that four months. Hey, but you don't amortize it, right? And you, when you amortize it over twelve months, we are pillar. Oh, nah, they think you're not twenty-five. Yeah. yeah. Which is why you see most actors are from one job to the other, to the other, to the yeah. other, to the other. Because that's the only way to have some sort of sustainability. That's the only way your debit orders can keep going off. Mm. But there is no million. What? By data. By clients. Uber grand. There's none of that. And this is, this is, this is why. Really out. Sign off. And I have to touch on this. Of course. Of course. This is why. I was out to show Allah when it came to the dishes. That, mm. uh, that I know. Mm -hmm. I know this because you were part of the crew that said, hey, 
Indeed. We enter them. G16, Baba. See ya, bang Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, what was she with? Hey, Spanish Pedi is in just business. Tina does it for us for the amount yes. that is due to us. Absolutely. When the citizens, it is Spanish. Hey, but in La Bantu Batia, these people want to live like the characters they play on TV. Hey, but isn't that the point? But what's, what, what, why not? <laughs> isn't that the point? Minimum, so like, do you not want to play Italy? Yes, sir. And the buyers are going to say, Gosh, I can throw up. It was a 19 million per year budget at that time. Oof. That they are getting. Oh my god. At that time. Huh? And then they're, 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 they're still taking over 800, 800 bucks. So SABC makes yeah. that money from right. this show. Yeah, and it works exactly like government antenna because government is making all this money, right? SABC gets the stuff. 818 million from. From, from generations. And between 800 and it's a lot of year. millions. Right. You are 120 million short of a bill. Yes. You understand? It's a lot of millions. That's where though. you are. That's where you are. So what SABC does is hire the best production company, that being Egg Food, mm. at that time. Yeah. To say, here's what you guys are going to get per year. This is the budget we give you to produce the show. And that was 19 million per year. My God. Because it's a public company, all those uh, figures are out there. You have access to that. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's, 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 it's a government company, so yeah, you say you, information absolutely. is out there. Yeah. So, we didn't know this. You know, you live in a little bit of a bubble in a cocoon for a long time. Only when this happened, this is our lawyer. I've been telling you, these are the figures, this is what's going on. Yo, that too, we can't. Yo, because it's like, there's a lot floating around here, you know? There's a lot of people who are increasing. Yeah, his partners were in his company, I think it was MMSV at the time. Uh, <clears throat> or have they gone back to Morula? I'm not sure. But his partners, the Starks, were building studios. They are making so much money yearly that they are able to save enough and capitalize and build Stark Studios. And for something like 120 million. No, so, they do not do a lot. Do you understand? Could do. Blind. Like them. So when we get this information, we just like we, like we can't allow this to continue without at least getting something. Mm. In terms of residuals, in terms of uh, um, royalties, uh, in terms of pay in Christiana. I won't tell you. Besides that, like, I'm, um, I'm an omnibus. Besides like pain. Because we don't pain. <laughs> I don't know. I think so. I think so. They should. So, it's a Saturday morning. But I mean, I mean, this is not dollar, I know. It's a certain amount, at least 5%. Definitely. Definitely. Because Definitely. it's a Tata ET. But space. more than that, more than that, there's people in Jamaica. There's people in Sweden. There's people in Puerto Rico and places like that where you said we get what here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Generations of them are yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. subtitles or um, voice dub yes. type vibes, yes. but we are known in those places, which means they've sold it. Yeah, yeah. Matthew McConaughey. Um, eight years, eight seven. Years. Eight years. Eight years. Eight years. from episode one. That's By rights, I should still be every month. Getting a check of sorts because of all the places it's still playing at. And nothing. Where? <laughs> Are you guys still fighting? Where? Not Are really. You still in court? I, I'll be honest, not really. Um, and it's part of the stomach, to tell the truth. The moment the other actors, including myself, you get comfortable in a new space, mm. you kind of want to forget that. And also, I mean, it's a bit of a People moved on to, you know, mm. Kings of Joburg, and, 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 and. You know, when you are acting and you are able to put food on the table, and pay off your bills, you kind well, of lose the, like, ah, as in, Yeah, you lose the urgency born, of that fight. I say, so born. No, 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 the late means in Gubani nice. Absolutely. Absolutely. And then absolutely. The, absolutely. Absolutely. A godfather in the acting Kutmala. 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 How Kutmala. was it acting along that guy? Great. Like, awesome. awesome. Le out the Anna Lapani is CPC, we shall is valid in Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, spana. Like, the dedication to. Getting this thing right because he was honest with himself. Okay? Mm. Um, he doesn't have the strongest handle of the English language, right? Yeah. But what he will do is study. Okay. What he will do is sit down with these crazy. words because he's a manager, he's a GM of the company. Mm. There is going to be times where he needs to talk certain jargon yes. and whatnot. Yes. But of course, script is translated in so that he brings naturally. Yeah. But all of that stuff planned to the T. Yeah. Literally on the script, right? Yes. You know? They, yes. Like, Meticulous. Yeah, I have instances where you would bounce because boys would like. No, no, not. You'd have to bounce back and forth the script. And I miss that environment because we all had um, 
the what is it, these dressing rooms next to each other. Mm. It's essentially a, a bedroom to yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you've got your bed in there, you can put your stuff in there, you can get a fridge, you can get a your TV if you want to bring your stuff in there. And he basically spent most of his time, as soon as he's at work, he's in his dressing room. Yeah, yeah just by the corner, yeah. Yeah, I was a fucking one to repeat. Ah, yeah, boss. Yeah. Keep me in the bed. <laughs> so, um. I found an investigator for him, man. My nigga. <laughs> Oh, I'm impressed, man. <laughs> I was like, how do you know that? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's dope. That's dope. So, yeah, like, we spend a lot of time, especially on a day when you know you've got, you know, eight, nine scenes coming up. Mm. And they're all kind of heavy. You know, In one day. Like, Senzo's storyline was always heavy. Like, when did yeah. that nigga not have drama? <laughs> so, <laughs> every day. Um, and the law funny in a scene. But that's, you know, in the dynamics of the relationship, he's kind of the girl. So, young kid was just like, a kind of food. Yeah. Hey, no. <laughs> Drama. <laughs> Drama. You learned a lot from acting that there, Totsi. A lot. Yes, 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 his passion. Any outing in Ibona, he actor with a similar drive. Mm-hmm. Though, though as I'm, I, I never worked with him, I just saw from a distance. Who he called out to be actor as, I just forget his name, Uchu. Uh, what was it? Was it backstage? Yeah, backstage. Oh, yes, yes, yes. This is yeah, I remember what I was doing during your time. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, I do remember experiencing him on set also, and he's one of those that's just like... Yeah, he's one of those. He, I, I, he's blank to the outside world. Like, oh, just completely. Come. Completely. Yeah. And he's immersed in the character. That's it. He's living it. Even before he goes on the uh, like, yes. studio yes. to go shoot, yeah. And then my fear, and then yeah. people would say this guy's a bad actor, but it's for strange. me, that all of that was planned. And mm. I saw him planning Uba Ile Ope today. Right. And he made awkward from it. Was, absolutely. He's an institution, we're talking about him right now. Yeah. All he had to say was Juke. I'm like, I know exactly who's a bad He's an institution. My name is Kanjum Ganom Yufuna. Sugani Kimba. Hey, Pedro. Which is boy I must see be seen. Proximity to Uzai. power. <laughs> Proximity to power is better than power, my brother. Oh, president was clearly the idea. Proximity to power. Hey, what are you? Talk to me about that. Come on. Um, oh, and those were the good days. <laughs> because you know when you have when you have started a revolution, right? A revolution. You like mean. you decided to burn the house down. Mm. To get your point across. Mm. And it's beginning to look like it's bearing fruit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because now people are like, hey, let's have a man's gosh. Let's call the fire brigade. Let's call everybody here. Yeah. There's an emergency, you know? Yeah. And everybody was willing to listen to us for that first month, you know? It's a she's in that. Yeah, it's, it's a she's in that. It's a prepared name. La Lela. La Lela. La Lela. You know? We are literally going to meet the minister. We are literally sitting down with Zolin Zimavavi. Like, the, 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 it was different meetings and different. Um, sort of occasions to sound out people mm. and let them know where we are at and what kind of support can we get. Yes, yes. Um, but basically lobbying to say, join our fight, let's make sure this institution that is Generations does not get taken off the screens. Yeah. But these are our conditions for it. We're not trying to burn this thing down. Mm. What we're trying to do is bring attention to some of the things that have been a problem for a very long time. Yeah. Help us in this. Yes. And we had a lot of people here. We were at uh, Ntuli House. So we were at... Like so many little clandestine You guys could have started your own jealousy on the side. Yes. <laughs> it was real, that thing. I, I mean, we, we had the Dalimbo for representing us for a short period of time. The advocate. The advocate. Mm. You know? Um, Wait, at that time, wasn't... Oh, he had just moved from being the group C of the... SAPC. He had moved, yeah. Okay. He has, was no longer there. Which was great, because he had so much inside info. Yeah. You know? Um, and he had so much good counsel and good advice of how to tackle this thing. Yeah. Uh, Chamberlain, I told yeah. Once we moved on from Bulelan, he was also someone we counseled with. Um, yes. But yeah, we had, we had, we had, we had, you know, the world in our hands at some point because everyone was willing to listen. Yeah. Because it seemed completely impossible, or at least improbable, that this show will be taken off air. I you mean, know? at the time, you guys are hitting a good 12 bar. Yeah. Per night. episode. Mm. If at night. 8 o'clock. Per night. Gonna 12 million people yeah. watching. Yeah. And then you're gonna just stop that because of only right. the two percent. Two percent million. The two percent that you promised. It that is contract. in your contract. It's your contract. We have to say moderate. And then I know. But I do understand. 
and I, and I, 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 I need to explain this so that it's, 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 it's very clear from a business perspective because once you get to that level, those kind of decisions trickle down mm. and you could bankrupt yourself. Because here, like where the problem lies is that 2%. That 2% of 880 million was to be split amongst the principal characters, all 16 of us, right? Yeah. 880 million of that. So you're yes. talking a good, you know, 20 million. Easy. Every, every year. It divided. Many divide, yeah. right? That's for each and every single one of us going back all the way to all the first actors. Because if they had paid us out, man, they man, would have man, had man, to man. pay everybody. So can I go a Chimoroka? Wongo Mundu. No Vanetta. Wongo Mundu. Pema no Vanetta. Where are they moving? Wongo Mundu would have had to be paid. Abo, 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 fana mukwe na. Yeah. Uguza Yeah, yeah. And that's what a class action is, right? Ah, uh, shut down the business. Shut down the business, my man. Dog. With this contract, when was it? When was it put together? The, it's an old Safritel contract, and this is where they messed themselves. The up. two percent contract. It, it's an old Safritel contract from 1984 that oh, they literally just cut and paste snap. and moved a few uh, letterheads and put that over there and set side at the bottom. So back in '84, so they two percent was not a problem. Oh, yeah, I've been seeing some of you and you guys were talking about. It was not a problem. Yeah, back then, you know. But when you forward date all of that and you consider that what since starting in ninety three, mm. when, when did generation start? But they would have had to basically backdate and pay every Ah, here's a busy man's work broke. And that's where the shift happened because everyone that we spoke to, from president to uh, youth league to Kosatu to everyone was like, Don't worry guys, we've got you, we'll sort this thing out. President was like, no, no problem. I'm speaking to Shabu on Monday. I have a meeting with him coming up every week. This is what we do. I'll raise this with him. This is going to be sorted out. Don't worry. Yes. Ah, from there, Vana, for the next two weeks, hey, it's your phone, your phone. Up and down. What's going on, guys? What's going on? What's going on? Some of the people that were taking your call and inviting you to spaces and saying, come join us. Yes, There'll be shortfall over here. <laughs> we'll give you gigs as teal and none, 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 just to. Because for those couple of months, we're not earning money right now, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. For those couple of months, while we're on strike, we are looking at options, but there were many options on the table, you know? Mm -hmm. But let's start with Mom Keys. Before Mom Keys had bought Royal AM, she yeah. was looking for things to invest in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And one of the things she was willing to invest in was a studio in mm -hmm. Durban yes. that we will then have the responsibility of administering content. Okay. Great idea. Yeah. yeah. But selfish minds pulled in different directions. Yeah. That also dynamics. 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 Politics of this? Come on. Yeah. Those are called. No, no, call. This was. Yeah. Right now, but I. But that is. Yeah. Just yeah. 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 Six months from, from the time you know, just like that, the group is nice. Group ya kulu, you have to ask him four thou, four thou, uh, two months before. Uh, how many people are participating in the group? Three. So say I'm funny. Then not only why did I pay noon, but the group. Still, yes. Ah, group alone can walk away. Right? I'm going to move. Yeah, it just kind of quietly fizzled away. We had, we had a group, what's a group? But you've had amazing roles, my dog. I mean, you've yes, sir. Uh, you've done Ikazi. Yes, sir. Um, one of my favorite characters. Yeah? One of my favorite characters. Me. Because it was the first time I got <coughs> to play someone not on the good side of morality. Yeah, but both told you that. Yeah. 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 And one of my roles before that were good boys. Good boy, good moral character. Mm. Like anyone that their mother would be very proud to bring home, you know? We did greed and desire. I did greed and desire. That was also after. Yeah. Uh, that was after Ikaz. That was after Ikaz. So, yeah. Like that was me exploring the dark side, you know? Yeah, but let's, let's, let's go back to Ikaz because you see it was one of the best. Favorite, favorite, favorite. Because it's, 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 it's steeped in so much of the dynamics you see in families all the time. Yeah. And it's ambition. It doesn't just born up in the much a much a that kind of funny stuff. But see, Levant, we we pay this. We're not Levant, we're not from China. Hello, Levant. Hello, Levant. Hello, my love. Uh, I'm in the podcast right now. Ask Chris, man. Can I call you back after? Okay, cool. We'll do. Ah, big ups to you. You still call him my love. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. But stick to things, okay? Like, <laughs> you can't start this way and then fizzle out. There's a cause, that's just the happiness. That is she cheated. The man you know, man. But wait, I'll wait. 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 Sure, Jam. When I have a high five. No hugs and kisses. Hey, nah, 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 nah. Get it out of there like a thief in the night. Yeah, we're buddies. <laughs> Shut up, <shut>, bitch. <laughs> it does the point. It yeah, yeah. So it's 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 the. And I was watching Shanghai Lebe right now and I was like, amazing, it's amazing beautiful. production. It's, 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 it's beautiful. It's like, it's one of those, like, you cry as an actor because we all, we all, like, have the ambition of having a role like that. <laughs> Being part of a production like that. Yeah, you know? And I'm going to get a little Oh, man. But it's that, it's that, it's that uh, that you see in the ambition of a mother that wants her child to be mm. the best. It's the ambition in the child to make the family proud. Yeah. But get what's theirs. Yeah. You know? Yeah. In final Zam and will chase them no matter what. Yeah. You know? It's obviously happening make far, it happen. far bigger scale because you are royalty. You are the son of the chief. Mm. You know what I mean? Uh, and the repercussions of your actions are far bigger. Yeah, of course. That's basically family dynamics. That's it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh Baba Ute Ubaba's not feeling this one, but now this mother feels that my son has the right to. Mm. Um, it is a further illustration that people are not necessarily evil, but are as selfish as their circumstances. That they will do whatever they need to do, no matter what that is, to make Wait, right. Which is not like a WhatsApp status right now. They are selfish. <laughs> Say that again. People are not necessarily evil. Mm. They are only as selfish as their circumstances. That hits home. Yeah. Because, 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 because the most circumstances, what, what, what you're living, what, what's mm. around you is what makes you limit what you're going right. to give out to the world. Right. Right. Or, or let come or let in. Let come in. And what you are willing to do. Yeah. To protect those things. Yes. You know? Are you justified if someone breaks into your house mm. and tries to do evil in your household? Of course. Are you justified in your actions towards them? Of yeah. course you are. Yeah. But if you randomly met someone in the street who's shy and jail. I'll see. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So it's not necessarily that a mother that wants this crown at all costs and is willing to poison the father who says he's not going to get this crown. Mm. You know what I mean? Mm. To her, she's doing what's necessary and what's right by her son. Yeah. And that far outweighs what the spillover might be. Not of time, not of time. It doesn't matter. She, it does that. Because in, in the, what's important is, is, is the vision and the idea of a Absolutely. Absolutely. And I love that. I love that. I, and, and like we got to play that out with my first Casa character, big one. It was so many firsts, you know. I got to act with Fatiswa. Mm. Fatiswa and Another amazing actor. Amazing. amazing. Right. But like energy also. Like, if you know Fatiswa, man, it, it, like it's crazy what <laughs> the person you see on screen and the person you experience in real life is two completely different things. Yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah. Like she's like she has a young energy. She has a back and forth and she's dope people yes. you know um and just being in those surroundings man it was it was it was it felt epic i think also for me it was the chance to break out of studio mm. shooting in studio is very yeah you also had a lot of outside scenes yeah no yeah. we're shooting on location we are going to actual places yes know? We went to Coffee Bay. We went to go shoot at a cliff. Oh, it wasn't a mm. created as a discussion less space. Let's recreate into something else. No. Yeah. They found a house out there in Model Fontaine. Um and created that to look like the castle. Yes. But the rest of the stuff, the Eastern Cape stuff, the outside stuff, the hats and all that place. was actually in the Eastern Cape we shot for three weeks. So brilliant. Cool man. That was, loved that was amazing. It. Loved it. Loved it. And then and then from there the team created design. From there is it to create a desire. Uh, yeah, it just feels, it feels like so long ago right now. Because <laughs> I don't remember the dynamics of like how that came about. So fair, look, about 2017, you know, 2016. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no. Yeah, uh, that I was approached by Oka. Oka Media, yeah. Um, and I've always had a great uh, relationship with uh, Porsche. Yeah, yeah. Great writer, great creator. Yes. You know? 
Um, and it's they, one of those they, things they, they did do. 48 hours, which I, I presented uh, an episode, yeah, which mm-hmm. was an educational show on the CBC. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it was like another opportunity to work with greatness. Yeah. You know, in my opinion. And it was great that we had a lot of the guys from Generations there, Tato. Um, Tato Mola. Yes. Yeah. You know. Um, Rakosa, mm. you know. Uh, but also to meet new people, to experience new great actors. Yes. You know. Yes. Um, and, 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 and look, for me, Green Desire was short-lived because it had so much potential to be so much more. Went to season three, four, five. It did, and it should have. You know what I mean? It, like, it should have been an institution yeah. by now. Yes. You know? uh, but I think it's channels sometimes and just a bit of short-sightedness in, in wanting new content and wanting greater content yeah. um, and always chasing numbers. Yeah. You know? This chasing numbers. Yeah. Thing, dog. It's, it, it, it's messed up the industry because now you don't find talent. Now you find how many people you have following you or liking you. Mm-hmm. And then no one's going to tell it. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Person can act all. You don't mean nothing. Yeah. From Mixit, Bamlande, Facebook, Twitter. Numbers. 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 That's really it. And, and it's whack because the numbers peak on the first day only. Yeah. But viewers aren't stupid. Like once we watch and see what you are, no? So you got your numbers for episode one. Sure. And that's it, done. Maybe week one. Yeah. After three weeks, you realize that. Lady yeah, comedian. No people there. When's I need the comedian? Lady comedian. That's me. That's Denzel. That's Lips. That's KB. Yes. Uh, it's a media company. Production. Production. Communications. Communications. But we've mostly been doing corporate. Yeah. Those corporate spaces, uh, corporate messaging around their own initiatives, that kind of thing. Okay. Now I can back into back into back into corporate. We yeah. Have to office it. Yeah. 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 Uh, no. No. But not even us in the office. Right. No. No. We go and speak to them. Yeah. Uh, what are your briefs for the year? You know, safety, don, 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 and then we create little plays okay. um, that speak their didactic messaging. Yeah. I mean, I think I saw something on, 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 on YouTube, if I'm not mistaken. Is that the place you're talking about? Those short five minute plays that you guys have? Yeah, 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 okay, yeah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah. okay. That's, that, that that's you guys doing that? Yeah. Okay. That type of thing. Um, and also going on site. Um, so they'll bring their employees for a half an hour. We put on a show for them. 15 minutes and then it's QA session afterwards. Mm. Yeah. That type of thing. So so how where is that going? How far well, do you know go? where we wanted to grow to now is because yes, that is dope because it pays bills. Mm-hmm. Um, there's always money in corporate for those kinds of things and they have to spend the budgets. Yeah. Um, but it's not feeding our creative uh, knowledge enough. Okay. You know? Um, so right now there's a couple of things in the pipeline. Uh, potentially Netflix, um, Evod. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we'll be writing a few shows right now. Nice. Mm. Nice. You said to me last week that mm-hmm. I was out in Eastern Cape. Eastern Cape. Eastern Cape. <laughs> I was out yeah. in Eastern Cape, yeah. My boy Mati has his own production company with uh, yes. um, Mukati. <coughs> Mukati, yeah. Mukati Mafati, yeah. Back to Square One Films. the <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Uh, it's crazy because uh that's my dog. <coughs> that show of theirs that they did together back in the day. Where he was Fistos and the other one. But anyway. No, no, no. Thomas Kometo was on that. No. no, is, no. is it not the one? No, no. Okay. Thomas was famous for other things at the time. He was also a staring of sorts. That's what you said. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay. Anyway, that's how I got to know Thomas. The acting and stuff. Came later, but he's a powerhouse right now. Ah, but I'm not so sure. I'm not so sure. Oh yeah, oh yeah. 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 I don't mind. Yeah. Look, uh, he's not essentially in sports. He's, 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 he's in TV production. Okay, right. sorry. It's a sports movie. It's a sports movie. It's yeah. a sports movie. It's, it's a sports movie. It's work. Yeah. But, they are, they are. but it's actually more about the family. Yeah. Like the right side is, is a B storyline to what's actually going on in yes. this young man's life. Are, you, are, are we looking at any, any, any productions that you're going to be in except for you just mentioned Netflix? Like, like, yeah, just finished this one right now. There's a couple of stuff. Um, there's two projects that I'm actually about to make. 
podcast. I saw you the couple of months ago, not writing Gubini at a yeah, price yeah. somewhere. Nenza, yeah, yeah. are you guys putting some? Hey, yeah, that's, that's some kind of friends. Place. Like that's some kind of friends. Like Sibani. I know, dog. Like no, and no. we're all interconnected. Yeah, you know. Um, but the guys are producing quietly in their own corners, man. Mm. There's another friend of ours, um, Ohadi. Uh, Smart Data Productions. The yeah. uh, writers with them. With the, that kind of production stuff. So. Yeah, because right, you never see him. You see him looking at something, you know. Yeah. Born, yeah. No, within a month, there's a production company. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Disappeared again. Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. But we all had to become, you know, streetwise. I'm going to the food, man. Exactly. And give other children a chance, man. I'm going to be famous, man. It's about the same food. Yeah. Today we'll make money and build homes. All right, my dog. So now we make it happen here. We talk about making it happen. Mm-hmm. Our, our who would who's trying to make it happen in this industry? Yeah. You have, and I wanted to have you here, and I said it to you, but mm-hmm. you've kind of had the best and the worst mm-hmm. of this industry, and you've mm-hmm. had it mm-hmm. see big. Yeah. yeah. Not what you too big. Sure. Similarly to what this was, uh, uh, which mm-hmm. experienced with, right, with um, the late Shona and right. what happened to Naboli Mali. Mm-hmm. We see the glamour. Ah, I never even thought Right, it's a bargain. Inside. Ah. But I inside, but it's a different story. Um, How do you make it happen? How do I get there? Study. People always assume with the acting industry you can. Yeah, don't say need to know people. Before you know, and to be when I was on Kulmela. It's not that kind of industry. I'm not sure. You're my dog. <laughs> I mean, if you were a doctor, who was a was on fire and make me a doctor. Oh, point exactly. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, point um, exactly. Because oh. I've had that number. I'm not a man. 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 <laughs> <laughs> so how do you make it happen? Um, did you study this? I studied. Do this. I have I, to go I, study? I, 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 like I went to this. You know, I have B A D A in dramatic arts. You know. Yeah. Um, and the thing that I always insist on is to base yourself and immerse yourself with knowledge yeah. of the space you are going into. People want to take an example of someone who was taken off the street. As a beautiful somebody, got a low also act. Yeah. Or someone that was an extra that worked their way into it and was made a lead over time. Yes. There are those stories. Yeah. Definitely. Success story. But those are outliers. Yeah. That's a 1% or a 0.01%. It exists, mm. but it's not See, the oh, one. for everybody. Yeah. It's not going to be the same. Also, you are guaranteed sustainability in an industry. If you know it in and out, yeah. if you have studied it, because once the acting thing dies down and you do grow older, like let's say you were a young hunk when you were 25, you were Mr. Six Pack, you were Mr. Vest and whatnot. What happens when you're 45 and that six pack and the vests don't quite work for you? Yeah, man. You know what I mean? Yeah. What kind of roles are you doing then? Yeah. Are you able to create your own work? Are you able to write and create stories yes. and create content? Yes. Are you able to put together a production and begin to tell your own stories? To the rest of the world mm. because that's where the longevity actually is yeah. that's where the sustainability actually is and you see it with so many you look at from Dandala, you look at connie ferguson you look at so many people that were great actors when you look at them on screen and it makes sense those people all have production companies yeah those people are all working for the bottom line yeah away from this that's is true yeah, this is true well, the names that you just mentioned yeah. and yeah. others that that, 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 that we know so many others Tony Karoche. Yes. Yes. So, yes. So many others. Those are the oh, guys. Okay. Those are Thank you, Zay. Prime example. Yeah. That man did that comedy thing. Six comedy six thing. Six comedy six 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 six. Six. I've got Nine training, I've got training. Yes. And we studied. People don't do, 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 do. There's a lot of people that have done so much in terms of big, like backing themselves up with knowledge yeah. and making sure because you are then able to take this thing and say, I can create my own little yeah. industry. Yes. Yeah. Which I network, yeah. It's what it means. And the, for, for me, how do you make it happen? You gotta want it hard enough. You gotta have a genuine passion for it. Genuine, genuine passion for it. Because there's many hungry days, eh? Yes. There's many long days. Yes. Anyone that's been an extra on any set will give you the worst stories mm. about what it's actually like to be on set. Oh man. You know? Yeah. Terrible, 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 terrible. I've experienced a few. It's not easy that thing. <laughs> it's not easy that thing. And you're an afterthought. Yeah. But when you are needed, you are needed now. And don't mess it up. If it is a minute, but you cut, also you don't matter. Yeah. 
<laughs> so <laughs> as soon as the director comes back on the floor to block the next thing, they're like, what are these extras still doing here? I was, dog, I was, I was shooting, I was shooting a movie. Twenty. Just after I can see our stories, mm-hmm. right? So shoot, 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 Every big money, they just 10 minutes ago. Yeah. <laughs> I was, every, every camera was on me. Yes. 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 Makeup. Why do you have to open my They I'm tired. 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 I'm So sorry. I don't matter no more. I mean, you're a fortunate few because the majority of extras are there with public transport or their own means. Yeah. You know? Hey, now you get wrapped at uh, six hours. Catch up! Catch up! Catch up! Catch up! Catch up! Catch It's terrible. Yeah. It's terrible. So, like, that passion has to be there. But yeah. the know-how you get through throwing yourself into things. There's no time to be shy in this industry. Yeah. That's how you make it happen. Yeah. You need to throw yourself into things. You know? I remember a story I tell often. My first year at this, I was a boy from Kimbat. Because I have told myself, no, I'm just here to study. I'm here to do the work. In class. Yeah. I'm going to do the theory, I'm going to do all that stuff. But in terms of getting into plays and putting myself out there, I'm not going to do that. You know? After a while, though, I start seeing my friends in plays. Yeah. They are auditioning. They're putting yeah, themselves yeah, out there. Imagine. Yeah, they got shit. But they got to go on and the band's a light station with your arm and they're shining. Yeah. Easy. Like, I could be 10 times better than that. Yes. You know? And slowly but surely, that little itch became a scratch that needs to be scratched right now. Yeah. And you go beyond yourself to say, actually, if I am too scared to get up on a stage and show what I'm worth, then what's the point of doing this whole thing? Your wife would you yeah yeah. What what what's the point of doing this whole Why thing? Is if, that if, if, if you are gonna put yourself out there, yeah, you know? And from there onwards, it was just like everything I could get into, I got myself into. Yeah. You know? Um there's no time to be shy. Uh, like shy is a wonderful thing, it's cute when you're a kid. But the moment you grow up and you aren't able to speak for yourself, if someone asks you what do you want and how can I help you? You can't say no my e. Hey. Come to me with a plan. Uh, no Come to me with the that. knowledge. Yeah. That says, Father, I'm aware you're producing, you're doing such, you're doing such, you're doing such. Uh, I've got an ability with sound. In the sound, we can't play it now. Oh, corner, corner. Dog, the same thing. thing. Just jump in there. The same thing happens with with, with our podcast right now. Yeah. Everybody in the world says, I don't know how far I'm going to go now. Okay, sure. Okay. Um, Sure. Why? What are you gonna do? Oh, okay. What are you able to what are you do? Bring it. Thank you. Sounds good to write this. Thank you. What value are you gonna give? Absolutely. What's your value? Yeah. Mm. And we are not saying because you 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 like you are just another number. All I'm saying is come to me with an idea. Season. Not with no idea and let's see what will happen. Yeah. Like that's the homework you need to do for yourself. Be ready with something. You know? I've been doing push-ups for the last six months. If you guys ever need a cover model for a swimsuit thing, use me. Hey man, it's not much, but at least you are giving me an idea of how I can utilize you. Noted boy. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. That's it. I've got, got you in mind. Yeah. We know. Do you know what I mean? But count me with a plan. Have a plan, you know, but that's where studying comes in. Yeah, that's where knowing the market that you're about to immerse yourself in because it also if teaches you know something what about you're going into. Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. And the discipline also in yeah. going into that. Yeah, because now most of the game, of fundus would more feel like a for sure. You should also expect to sure. visit that. For and sure. when that funnel looking yeah, yeah, there's so many people that started off wanting to be actors and actresses that are executives at multi choice right now. Mm. Executives, because on a degree, mm. you went to one or two auditions, you got your first role or maybe your second role, were born um, and six months as keep. But let me keep myself busy because I, I can chop off from backstage. I could have chop off from backstage. After that, you had to get a cup of mineral. Business. This man was driving up and down toward the mines in the Northern Cape and back here. Deals. Yeah. Yeah. Apply your stuff. 
The money and the sustainability is not in being famous. We don't pay enough for that here. We pay a lot. We pay a lot. But it's not sustainable for the rest of your life. Yeah, of course. It simply is. I've actually a hundred million image. Oh, no, 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 you wish. No, that sounds like a dream, my dear. You wish. You know? It's a Hollywood idea. It's, it's a Hollywood idea. Yeah. Um, there's an example of Matthew McConaughey. White guy, blonde hair. Yes. Uh, famous actor. Done so many great movies and has worked and still working now. But this is his biggest paycheck. Biggest paycheck to this day. How to lose a guy in 10 days. Oh, yeah. Some rom com from yeah, 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 yeah. was one of his first works. But it's been played so many times. ETV, Gupi Gupi, to this day. To this day, that man gets a residual check of a couple of hundred thousand every couple of months because mm. of that movie. That's <laughs> 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 So the reason why I'm asking you this is in your boy, are you in a mm. good space? Are you in a good space because you're telling me and the, yeah. and, 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 and my guys? Yeah, is this for PR or is it not for real? I mean I come from my son's eighth birthday. Yes. You know? Um I'm 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 constantly I'm looking for the word exactly. But I'm constantly checking and rechecking. Checks and balances, but having those internal conversations. Yeah, you need those internal conversations. Very much. Candid. Candid conversations. Very candid. Candid conversations with yourself. Yeah. Um, and there's, no, there's a quote I saw the other day that just like, it hit me. Real growth begins when you get tired of your own shit. Oh yeah, of course. Do you know? Like, <clears throat> of course. But how do you get tired of your own shit if, you are, if you're not having honest conversations you with yourself? You introspect. That's it's that way. introspection that is required. You know? uh, I pride myself on being able to have the difficult conversations in life, mm. in my relationship, yeah. um, with myself, yeah. um, with my spiritual guide. I've got a sage now. Mm. Like, I'm at that place in life where I'm like, I need spiritual counseling. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Um, Which is important, Doc. For sure. It's very for sure. important. Because you honestly believe when we're younger that I can base this life thing on myself. Young is there, right? I will worship myself. In pause. So on the yeah. I, You know? Yeah. Plus, you are too drunk and too hungry on a Sunday morning to make it. Ah, you might have the no. best intentions, but but there's a, a there's a different intentionality as you grow older. Yeah, yeah. With the things you prioritize, that one beer less at eleven o'clock on a Sunday night or on a Saturday night to make sure you're able to wake up at seven yeah. to make it to early morning service. Yeah. You know, those are intentions, and you are intentional about your your worship mm. and your spirituality. Mm. You need to be intentional about how you treat your spirit. And convict yourself. And convict committed. yourself. Yeah. And convict yourself. But put your own head on the block for yourself. Yeah. Make promises to yourself and keep them. And keep them. The thing is, they and we are so quick to forgive ourselves. For Which is small, not and right. And that is the problem. Because you let a lot slide. You never, you never hold yourself accountable. Yeah. But that's discipline, right? That stuff is not easy. But that's the difficulty of, 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 of growing up and realizing there is no one that's going to come and save me. There is no one that's going to come and do it on my behalf. Yeah, I did not buy means you. You, not me and the other who's going to assist. No. There is no knight in shining armor who's going to be like, Fana, it's fine. No my head, it's fine. I get him some guy. You know? I hear So if you don't hold yourself accountable and hold yourself in high regard while remaining humble to the people around you, but you need to be so full of yourself that you don't let yourself down. And that's that self-love stuff, right? Of course. You gotta love yourself me. first. It starts with you. Yeah. You know? And that's very important. But yeah, for me, my mental health and all that stuff, I really think I need to And if I were to ask you, I stay there. If I were to ask you, what are the things you love 
mm. in your life. How how long would it take you to say yourself to to, to mention yourself? Maybe third. Why? Because I love my relationship. Why? I love the space in work that I'm in. Yeah. Um. Because I see myself as a giver. I see myself as someone who thinks for others first. Um, to a fault sometimes, to tell the truth. You know? um, I'm a team player. I like the concept of team. Yes. No man is an island. No. It takes a village. All of those cliches yeah. are cliches because it's true. Of things because it's true. Yeah, I'm going to go and show you how to do it. You know what I mean? And there's been so much empirical evidence over the years, generations yeah. and generations, yeah. centuries. Of people proving. going through similar things, proving these cliches, yeah. you know? It takes a village. And for me, the concept of team is such that I need to do the best in support of you. So that one day, whatever success you have, or whatever strong position that you are in, the spillover is obviously going to come to me. But if secret, we are far better together yeah. than me completely alone. Of course. Two heads are better than one. Do you know what I mean? Um, and it's that concept in life, and uh, like we spoke about my love for sports, yeah. it has been fostered in that. Like, ooh, like what I learned on the sports field through hardship, through failure, through... Because we weren't very good as a team. CBC is not great at sports. Yeah. There was a lot of losing. <laughs> <laughs> but it was there. Yeah, there was a lot of money behind it. You know? yeah. But on those odd occasions where you do have success, and you do have a momentous day on the sports field, it's because of a lot of hard work and teamwork that actually came to fruition later. Yeah. You know? And I've based so much about how I view life and how I view my contribution in life as, as a team. You know? Like I'm a lover. I go from relationship to relationship. Um, before I met my current partner, it was, and I had to look back and that introspection stuff, I had to look back and be like, hey, in my entire adult life, I've been in three major relationships. I've never been single for longer than two months. Mm. As soon as Lady Pen, it's only a matter of time before I, I, like, like, I need to drop anchor somewhere yeah. and be like, I see. You know? okay. All my relationships have been long term. You know? Six years, four years, eight years. I'm on three right now. Yeah. Three years right now. You know? But that is it, it, purely because for me, in terms of constructing this life thing, I need someone to do it with. Oh, humble. But I also need someone to impart love and wisdom to, you know? And, but and also, help construct. But it doesn't work if it cannot be reciprocated. Absolutely. Right? Absolutely. Because then you, you just hit a stumbling block. Absolutely. But that's where that hard, hard conversations thing comes in. Gents, and even ladies, say some confrontation mm. of the small arguments. Mm. Of the, I don't like when you speak to me this way because hey, man, no, 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 no. what I'm saying is I don't like it when you do that. And I'm saying in future, just address me this way. Yeah. I'm like, what? I might just bang a couple of doors, not make you tea <laughs> later on that day. You're not getting bounced later that day. <laughs> sure. You know what I mean? But the message has taken root. Yeah, it is. Indeed. Next time she's gonna think twice before she But what happens if I'm an incident? What if happens if have the conversation? You keep having the conversation. Keep having the conversation and set yourself an ultimatum. Because it comes back to self-love. It's, 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 if you are not going to treat me the way I want to be treated, then I'm going to treat me the way I want to be treated. Thank you. And I'm going to put myself first. Then. Yeah, and then Lapao said, Thank you. So you are now at bay. Thank you. Ish. But those things are constructed. People think you just stumbled upon a great partner. You teach people how to treat you. Yeah. People only treat you how you allow them to treat you. Yeah, this is true. If you don't stand up for yourself, if you don't stand up for certain things, you know what I mean? Maybe you don't moan during sex. You don't like you moaning. Speak about this moaning thing. Have that conversation, even if it sounds stupid. It's but important she, she to you. <laughs> <laughs> That's the moaning. Just something. maintain no. that. <laughs> but sometimes when you have those conversations with your partner, you begin to realize, no, even this moaning thing, as a, you know, just like as a random example, even this moaning thing is an indoctrination from a previous relationship. Yeah. Where some nigga was like, oh, what's wrong? You know? Enjoy yourself, be free. It's only the two of us in this bedroom. Yes. I guess it's not laugh. But have the conversations. Have the conversations. You're so scared with, with your people, with the people you love. Yeah. 
Because people treat you the way you allow them to treat you. I see value, but otherwise it's a cool man. I guess it's a secret. Now my camera at the dopeness. Tell, 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 tell the make it happeners. Yeah, that's what we do. Dog, I was checking. So the new show will make it happen with kids, but we don't know what to call the uh, all our viewers, our right? viewers. Because others have those nice little oh, the <laughs> oh, the chairs. Oh. <laughs> make a competition. What? What do we call our guys? The makers. The makers. Can we, we are building, right? We are all making something. Yes. We make it happen. We make it. Because you're a maker. You gotta do it. You gotta make something happen. Yeah, but this isn't your makers. I suppose it will catch on. Talk to the makers. Make tell the makers. What, what what about you, dog? What are we expecting? Yeah. What, what what's coming? Yeah. Um, just talk to them. There's a platform. What up, good people? Like, like I feel like I'm on radio now. Go for it. Go for it. Chang it in. Chang it in. Let me let me start. That it's making it happen right here. My name is Fiso Kiss. I'm chilling with Utami Mungolo. That's right. My name is Utami Mungolo, and we out here on Make It Happen. For me, myself personally, I am doing a lot of things right now, man. Uh, do check out all of the things uh, that my production company is going to be coming up with. Uh, Black Acacia Media, there's Ledeca Media also, there's training programs we're going to be busy with in the Northern Cape. Uh, but at a entertainment level, um, I can't say too much right now because we're negotiating, but uh, do keep your eyes peeled on these uh, streaming sites, bringing you some dope stuff coming up. And uh, the support and the willingness to lend an ear yeah. when you see my face, let's keep that there, man. let's keep the love. Yeah. His name is Zit Lungelo. We know him as no, Otami Mungolo. Like, that's my son's name. I don't know what Google did over there. What happened? I have no idea what happened over there. So why we... I, I have no idea. That's, that's my son's name. Because I, I, was, I, I thought in Dwayne I could be Uwu Junior. No. Because of that. He is Junior because of my dad. All right. My dad is Zeke. Yeah. So we called him Elake Zeke Mungolo. Yeah. Lunge. Right. Okay. That's his name. But now you're... I don't know where Google decided. <laughs> yeah, I'm Tamsan. I'm Siluka Zuki. Yeah, I know. That's all good. A very good friend of mine, I love this guy. Yes, sir. Dog, thank you for coming through. Bad love, man. Appreciate it. It's Fiso Kiss. Appreciate it. Tamil Tamil. On all social media platforms. Yes, Let's sir. make it happen, makers. That's how we do. Salute till next time. That's how we do. It's gonna take root that makers. <laughs> it makes sense. <laughs>